the James Webb Space Telescope has simply sent Earth an enormous admonition, and it's drawing nearer. This cautioning comes from the exoplanet Proxima b. With each new picture sent back, additional inquiries emerge, leaving specialists frightened. Each description from this far-off planet makes us wonder more about the secrets of the universe. Developing inquiries are emerging about a potential hostile planet close to Earth. Might there be an adjoining outsider planet that has antagonistic goals? Might Proxima at any point represent a danger to our very presence? The subject of outsider life has interested mankind for hundreds of years, but with present-day innovation like the James Webb Space Telescope, it has become an inquiry we can explore more completely than any time in recent memory. Yet the universe isn't making it simple to find answers. We continue to utilize our best devices, for example, the James Webb Telescope, to catch glimpses of far-off planet systems, hoping to find hints that may indicate life beyond Earth. We should be practical, though. Every new picture and piece of information mostly reminds us of how little we really know. While these disclosures could be momentous, they likewise highlight the immeasurability and intricacy of the universe, leaving us with additional inquiries than answers. Figuring out a distant planet like Proxima b could reclassify our place in the universe. For researchers in astronomy, this is exciting, but for the overall population, it frequently feels like simply one more piece of space news, far off, conceptual, and at times overwhelming. These disclosures bring up additional issues than they answer, driving numerous to ponder how this affects life on Earth. Could Proxima really harbor life? or even intelligent life that could one day present a danger to us. Regardless of the colossal power of the James Webb Space Telescope, it can only show us so much. Sure, we've learned a few unimaginable things, like the reality that we now have staggering new pictures of Proxima b, and we know that the universe is significantly greater than we at any point imagined. However, what comes next? The reasonable ramifications of these revelations can feel as immense as the actual universe. Proxima b, found in 2013 due to its gravitational connection with its star, was a significant logical leap forward for numerous researchers. Finding this exoplanet was like discovering a new large neighbor. Proxima b is simply marginally bigger than Earth, and it circles its star like clockwork, making it a captivating subject for further investigation. From a scientific point of view, the thought of a different universe so close to our own is thrilling, yet for the vast majority, it's difficult to connect with a spot that is 25 light years away. To place that into perspective, even the quickest spacecraft people have at any point made would take tens of millennia to reach it. Imagine what it might be like to stand on Proxima b. Its star, Proxima Centauri, would appear as a major faint red light in the sky, a lot cooler and more obscure than our sun. Proxima b circles so rapidly that a year there endures a little more than seven days. One side of the planet generally faces the star, meaning it experiences perpetual sunlight, while the opposite side is covered in unending night. It seems like something out of a sci-fi novel, but the truth would be undeniably more fierce. On the bright side of Proxima b, any water would probably bubble into steam due to constant exposure to heat, while on the dark side, the water would freeze into solid ice. The planet's star, Proxima Centauri, is likewise not a quiet and consistent neighbor like our sun. It tosses out hazardous flares and extreme radiation, causing the outer layer of Proxima b to be a risky spot for life. As far as we might be concerned, this isn't the very sort of neighborhood where people would want to set up for business. Interest in tracking down life beyond Earth hit a peak in late 2020 when researchers identified a surprising signal coming from the Alpha Centauri system, where Proxima Centauri is found. This signal had a remarkable frequency of 982.551 MHz, which grabbed everybody's eye. Such a sign could, in principle, be an indication of advanced technology. It is extremely soon to draw any conclusions. All the more recently, the James Webb Space Telescope filled much more excitement by proposing that Proxima b could have water vapor in its atmosphere. Water, as we probably know, is a crucial element for life, and its presence could be a game-changer. To better understand how much water is present on Proxima b, researchers are utilizing advanced techniques like spectroscopy. This method permits them to identify the gases that surround the planet, behaving like a cutting-edge investigative tool. By examining the planet's light spectrum, 
researchers can distinguish specific gases like oxygen, methane, and carbon dioxide, which are all fundamental for life. Barometric modeling is another key methodology. By utilizing virtual simulations of Proxima B's atmosphere, researchers can make ballpark estimations about its conditions. These models serve a comparable purpose to how scientists use dinosaur fossils to speculate what dinosaurs could have looked like. However, the more we find out about Proxima B's atmosphere, the more we are reminded of the extraordinary variety of living things that exist here on Earth. Extremophiles, for example, are small organisms that can survive in extreme conditions, such as bubbling underground aquifers, acidic lakes, and the freezing cold of Antarctica. These resilient creatures show that life can adapt and flourish under conditions once thought unimaginable. Could life on Proxima B be similarly versatile? The quest for life on Proxima B presents colossal challenges, not just in terms of space travel, but also in proving that life can exist in such an unfriendly environment. The planet is bombarded by extreme space radiation, and its atmosphere probably won't offer much protection. Furthermore, the distances involved are so vast that new kinds of propulsion systems are necessary to make space travel to Proxima be plausible. Ideas like solar sails, particle propulsion, and even more theoretical concepts like warp drives offer exciting prospects for future exploration. However, these advancements are still in their infancy and require extensive research before they can be used in real missions. While dreaming about future space travel is exciting, we really need to stay realistic. Finding life on Proxima B is laden with technological and scientific challenges. Only by advancing our technology and expanding our understanding of the universe can we hope to unlock the potential of distant worlds like Proxima B. This pursuit isn't simply about satisfying curiosity. It's about pushing the limits of human accomplishment. Could we one day set foot on Proxima B or even interact with life there? As we consider the long journey to Proxima Centauri, finding aliens no longer feels bound to the realm of sci-fi but rather seems like a genuine, tangible possibility. This intriguing shift from a far-off dream to a scientific endeavor has drawn serious attention from cutting-edge organizations like Breakthrough Initiatives. These groups are committing colossal resources to transform what would typically be an incredibly lengthy journey, one that could take several millennia using today's technology, into a mission achievable within decades. The goal of reaching another star system within a human lifetime has ignited innovation and optimism in the academic community. However, these grand aspirations are quickly tempered by the stark realities of our current technological constraints. Despite remarkable advancements in space exploration, traveling to Proxima Centauri, even at 4.2 light years away, still presents overwhelming challenges. Current propulsion systems are simply not fast or efficient enough to make such a journey feasible in any reasonable time frame. Breakthrough Starshot, one of the most ambitious projects, imagines using powerful laser-driven sails to push tiny spacecraft to speeds up to 20% of the speed of light. While this concept shows promise, it remains in the experimental stage and requires overcoming various mechanical and logistical obstacles, such as mitigating damage from space debris and ensuring reliable long-distance communication. While the dream of reaching Proxima Centauri and possibly finding alien life is closer to reality than ever, it remains grounded by the limitations of modern technology. Accelerating a spacecraft to approach the speed of light with today's tools feels nearly impossible like trying to solve a difficult puzzle in the dark. Even ambitious projects like Starshot, which plans to propel a craft toward Alpha Centauri using lasers, face significant practical challenges. The Earth's atmosphere creates disturbances for the lasers, making it challenging for space exploration instruments to work with the accuracy required. One proposed solution is the use of adaptive optics. Smaller lasers on satellites that continuously monitor and adapt to atmospheric disturbances. This system would help powerful ground-based lasers stay focused on spacecraft as they travel through space. However, the laser propulsion method demands an enormous amount of energy, equivalent to the total energy consumed by the entire United States, and it would only work for a limited time. Imagine setting up 100 million lasers over a vast area just to push a small spacecraft, only 33 feet wide, to 20% of the speed of light. At this speed, the spacecraft would still take 22 years to reach the Alpha Centauri system, a time frame longer than many people's lifetimes.
However, the challenge of reaching Alpha Centauri isn't solely about overcoming technical hurdles. There are natural obstacles as well. The gravity of the sun, the presence of space debris, and the sheer immensity of the distance involved all pose critical risks. Even communicating with a spacecraft on course to Proxima B would require sending messages through time. It would take around four years for a signal to reach it from Earth. In spite of these overwhelming challenges, the desire to explore other star systems continues to grow. It's driven by humanity's deep-seated love for discovery and exploration, rather than practical need. Even bold endeavors like Starshot, which aims to shoot a spacecraft toward Alpha Centauri using lasers, face numerous practical challenges. Nevertheless, overcoming these issues could transform space exploration. Still, the potential risks involved, including communication delays and natural hazards, require intensive preparation. Despite the troubles, many researchers believe that the rewards far outweigh the risks. In essence, the possibility of reaching Proxima Centauri or discovering life elsewhere in the galaxy is something that could one day become a reality, albeit in the far future. For now, we must focus on improving our space technology, studying our neighboring planets, and seeking new ways to make these incredible journeys possible.